Hello guys, in this travel vlog, I cover complete details about Bangalore to Mysore expressway phases, distance, toll charges, travel time and other details. The Bangalore to Mysore expressway is also known as NH275. It is the shortest route between Bangalore and Mysore. Three hours or more are needed to get from Bangalore to Mysore. This trip time will be cut in half after the highway is constructed. The fast stretch would guarantee that People travel the journey in approximately 1.5 hours. All about Bengaluru Mysore Expressway. In the Indian state of Karnataka, the 117 km long access control Bengaluru Mysore Expressway will be constructed. This expressway would make it simple to travel from Bengaluru to Mysore once it gets finished. Bengaluru to Mysore travel time is little over 3 hours but can occasionally take longer owing to the traffic. The National Highway 275, 10 lane motorway between Bengaluru and Mysore will reduce the distance in half. Bangalore and Mysore would be connected by the project motorway which is a section of the NH275 road allowing for back and forth transit between the two cities. It will also connect Kerala, Kodagu and Mangaluru. Bengaluru to Mysuru Expressway Project Details The proposal for the Bengaluru to Mysuru motorway came in 2014. In two phases, that is in May 2019 and December 2019, work on this project began. Little could be done though because of COVID limitations. Instead of the original projection of June 2022, the project was completed in October 2022 and operational in March 2023. Bengaluru to Mysuru Expressway Toll Charges It has two toll booths. The Nice Road Junction is immediately followed by the Bengaluru End Toll Plaza. 
When traveling from Mysore side, the second plaza is located after Sri Rangapatna. The toll cost would cost between 200 to 300 rupees. As of January 2023, the toll collecting has not yet begun. Through Mysuru, Madikeri and Banwal, this route that is NH275 links Bengaluru and Mangaluru. The 117km long section motorway between the nice road on the Bengaluru side and the outer ring road on the outskirts of Mysore city is the fast, fastest route. The Bengaluru Mysore Expressway Inauguration The Bengaluru Mysore Motorway will be officially inaugurated by our Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji in March 2023 after the Sri Rangapatna bypass opens in February 2023. Travel time between some of the most well-known cities in Karnataka is predicted to decrease from 3 hours to 90 minutes or less than that thanks to the rupees 8000 crores corridor. National Highway 275 has been extended by NHAI to a 10-lane highway including the motorway. The majority of the stretch is already in use. Mysuru Expressway phases. The project is simultaneously developed in two packages. The motorway will contain 44 small bridges, 19 large bridges and 44 micro bridges in addition to 4 railway over bridges. Additionally, it will feature 50 underpasses for both automobiles and pedestrians. Phase 1. The first phase is located in Bengaluru and runs from Nidagatta to Panjamugi Ganapati Temple on Nice Road. A total of Rs 3,900 crore would be spent on the first phase, of which Rs 1,600 crore will be used for land acquisition. This phase roadways are around 56.2 km long. Phase 2 from Nidagatta to Mysore. This second package contains a land acquisition expense of Rs 1,200 crore with a road length of 61.1 km and an estimated cost of roughly Rs 3,600 crore.
two of the most important cities in the state are Bangalore and Mysore, which are beneficial for both business and tourism. One of the important highways in the state is the four-lane NH275, which is currently in service. However, the road is crowded and passes through the inhabited areas of Mandia, Mandur and Sri Rangapatna. It will not be permitted for motorcycles, scooters, auto rickshaws or other slow-moving vehicles to operate on this motorway. The motorway will be used by both cars and trucks. Two-wheelers and other lighter vehicles must use the service road. This expressway is expected to be inaugurated and opened in March 2023. Hi guys, thanks for watching and I hope you like the video and it helps in planning your trip. If you then please like and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates.